to be showing you how to make willow sticks and apple sticks by yourself. So let's get right to it. So I am gonna let this like kind of sit in here so that all the bad bacteria and stuff, the stuff from outside that's not clean can come out and then I'll like pour all this water out. And the reason why I'm using um, something like this and put these in here is because the sink is kind of dirty and I want to make sure that it's um, pretty clean so my chinchillas won't get sick. So I just realized that I didn't film the part where I cut the sticks. So all you need to do is you need to find sticks that are safe for chinchillas and then cut them the size that you want them and then start washing them with a toothbrush that um, is clean. So yeah. So once you're done soaking your sticks in water um, and brushing it with the toothbrush, you can pour out all the water or drain out all the water if you're just using a sink. And there um, should be a little bit of dirty stuff, as you can see. Also, if you're wondering what sticks we're using, we're using apple sticks. My, our chinchillas really like them, and um, I think they work really well. So, yeah. The next step is to boil the sticks. You can also um, just microwave the water, but I think I like boiling more. And you're just going to put the sticks in once the water starts bubbling. So the water is boiling, so we're now going to put the sticks in, and sometimes, um, and as you can see, some of the sticks are a bit long, so you can just flip the sides, um, like after a little bit. I think you can boil them for like two to three. As you can see, some of the sticks are a bit long, so you can just flip the sides. So right now we're flipping the ends because it's about like a minute now and you don't want to soak them too much so they're soggy. So we're just going to soak them for like about a minute again and then we'll come back. Okay, so I think they're all done. I Yeah, they're all done and as you can see, the wood on it will be like kind of shriveled up. So once you're done um, boiling your sticks, you're going to um, you're going to put it on like a saran wrap pan, and then after that, you're going to um, preheat your oven at 350 degrees. And so I'm going to wait and then I'm going to um, put the sticks into, onto the tray and just make them all spread out. You don't have to make them too spread out though. But also, um, if like you don't see the sticks kind of have like a wrinkled skin, like the bark is kind of wrinkled, then um, they're not ready yet and you can put them in for like another five minutes or like a two minutes or something. And yeah. So if that time doesn't work, then you can um, kind of add more time to it. So this is how 
it looks right now for me and I'm just gonna add a few just to make it kind of full and do it like this that and let's add this tiny one here okay so I'm gonna wait for my oven to um, Go, get to 350 and then I'll come back. I'm gonna try. See if she approves. I think she likes it. Let's see if Benny approves. Let's see if Benny approves of the stick. There you go. I think he really likes it. Yeah. So that's gonna be how you can make um these sticks for your um, small pets or anim or your chinchilla. So yeah, bye guys. Make sure to like and subscribe and hit that bell notification to um, um, 